Well, after a five-year hiatus, the Bristol derby is back. And a sellout crowd at Ashton Gate has certainly given the two teams a vociferous welcome as they run out onto the pitch. There's an early test for Lewis Carey. Walker knocks it back to Lambert. Cross comes in. It was Disley but it was underneath it. Keogh clears. City still haven't got it clear. And the shot comes in from Lambert and that's closer than his earlier effort. And Woodman bombs forward on the left. Here's Andrews and an important interception by Phillips. Craig Woodman plays it along the ground to the edge of the box, picked up by Noble. Not a bad effort from the midfielder but doesn't trouble Phillips in the Rovers' goal. Well, it's Campbell and it's just wide of Basso's right hand post here's Noble trying to play it forward to Brooker again under hit second charge here by Keogh who's not going to be the most competitive City player so far here's Andrews only parried by Phillips and Brooker puts it wide with the goal gaping well, it was a wonderful chance for Steve Brooker and I'm not sure he'll get a better chance than that. It was good play from Andrews, found himself in a ludicrous amount of space in the area really. It was a, a good shot, Phillips did well to parry it away but straight to the feet of Brooker who fired over when he really should have nestled the ball into the back of the net but the first real good chance going to City. Phillips with a goal kick. And that certainly was the best chance of the game. But here's Disley for Bristol Rovers. And hits it wide when well placed. And suddenly the game opening up at both ends. So the 64th minute of the game. Producing two chances. Here's Fontaine. Noble over the top to Brooker. Brings it down well, hits the post. Tremendous effort from the city number nine. And City going closer and closer to that Rubers goal. I go. And headed clear by Fonkeir Orr and the shot comes back past Basso. Coming into the final minute of normal time. Here's Andrews. Murray Williams with a header. Straight at Steve Phillips. And there is the final whistle, and Bristol Rovers have kept their fifth successive clean sheet. Biggest game of the season here. Now then, it's a good turn. Good save by Phillips. And then Rovers, it was Brooker who found space. He did so well, and Phillips diving to his right. It's a good start for City. Disley gets the flick on. Now this is Disley. He's done well, making space for himself. Now it's Haldane. There he goes, well played Lewis Haldane, he's round his man. Gets the ball in, Disley's shot, it's into the arms of Adriano Basso. Well played Lewis Haldane. The first corner of the match, 27 minutes gone. In it comes. Brooker's there, gets the header in. Straight to Steve Phillips. It's going to be Oigo and Campbell, Campbell. Well, that's the header, chance for Rovers, and my goodness me, is he going in and somehow Basso gets hold of it. And it was Craig Hinton. City gets that ball in. Oh, that was hooked away, that was dangerous. But it was Steve Elliott to make the uh, crucial clearance. See that, see that, see that, see that. David Noble there with the cross of Sun. There's the header, comes in, that's just wide. And... That was City going very close indeed there. Here we go then, Campbell. And it comes. Somehow it's cleared. This is Elliot. Igo's going wide if he needs to. Elliot needs to clip that ball in. Over it comes. Disley's there. Chance for Rovers. It's a goal. What a super strike. It's Ricky Lambert. The 
Look at the emotion here! It's incredible! Gas media! You can't believe it! I've never known an atmosphere like this! The gas have taken the lead! And what seas! Seas of disbelief! Johnson's paint glory is Ricky Lambert! Can Aaron Lescott get there? Still it's Brooker! Noble! It's a good ball, it's Johnson! Good trickery from Johnson! Still he's got the ball! It's Noble! High into the bass end! Paul Skuse puts his foot on it, clips it forward. It's aimed for McCoon. It wasn't far wide from Brooker! But to the joy of the Rovers fans, it ends up in the Bass Terrace. Are they going to let the ball come back? I don't think so. It is eventually. The noise is incredible. There it is! Rovers are at the Millennium! Steve Hen Phillips holds his head, he can't believe it. Let's rock and roll at the Mem. It's a glorious gas night.